guys, it's Laura. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I do videos on all things luxury, so if those are topics that interest you, please consider subscribing to my channel. Click the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos. So now that we're in January, I'm very excited because January means the first act of Chanel's spring collection comes out. It's the P collection, so right now we're in 23P. 23P is officially dropping in the US on January 24th, but a lot of photos have already been rolling out. VIPs have been able to go to previews, and so a lot of pictures of the bags are coming out on social media and so I wanted to go over the bags because I'm very excited for this collection. If you're a person that likes light colors, pastels, caramel, this collection is for you. They have some new mini top handles this season in a color combination, so a two-tone colorway, which is very exciting. They come in several colors, so first we have the solid colors. They're going to come in black, dark beige, light green. This light green is probably my favorite color of the season. It's absolutely gorgeous. Then there's also a light pink, which is more of like a Barbie bubblegum pink. The last pink collection, they also had a light pink, which is my light pink mini top handle. This is a very light baby pink, so the light pink this season is a lot darker than this one. And now looking at the two-tone bags, we have four different options. So the first is going to be the lilac, which is a lighter pink than the pink that we saw before with the one tone mini top handle and then it's going to be combined with a light green so you have that light green in the chain in the interior of the bag as well as accented on the bottom of the top handle next we have my personal favorite and it is the accru and dark beige this dark beige has like a light caramel color to it so i think this is absolutely gorgeous they have the gold hardware as well then we have the black with the lilac combination so that light purpley pink in the chain in the interior and again at the bottom of the top handle and then finally we have a green and a dark blue so this is a different green than that minty green it's a little bit darker next up are the classic flaps and this season is especially exciting because that beautiful caramel color is coming back but it's coming back in caviar leather before it only came in lambskin as far as the classic flaps were concerned and i know a lot of people wished that it came in the caviar leather if you're one of those people your wish is officially coming true because it is in the gorgeous caviar caramel color this season next we have a silver black white and gold option a lilac option it comes in that gorgeous light green which i think out of all the pastel colors that probably is the one that is my favorite it also comes in a light blue which is also very beautiful if you were a fan a few years ago of that gorgeous sky blue color that came out then this is the color for you if you missed out on that bag and then finally it comes in a dark pink and then a blue and white so again these are all the classic flap colors in the caviar leather if you're a fan of the 255 there are three options this season the first is going to be silver black white and gold then you have a beige and multicolor option followed by a blue and a white for the 255. There are also a lot of totes this season. So right now I'm looking at the Deauville tote. Last season we had the swimming pool Deauville. I'm calling these the baseball Deauvilles. You have a pink one and a black one. Then you also have these totes that look to be in lambskin and then you have that flap pocket. And you have this one that sort of looks like the 22, but it's not. It has these charms on the chain and then on the back there it says Chanel. So sort of like a seasonal variation of the 22 and it's in the black leather. Next we have these totes. There's some that look to be like they're denim. We have a basket looking tote. The hobo is back from 23C. But the bags that really stand out to me in this collection here is going to be those backpacks. Those are really cute. It comes in three different colors. So you have the lilac, the beige, and then black as well. There's also a lot of 22s this season, so that bag is not going anywhere. Let me know in the comments below, has this bag grown on you or do you still hate it as much as people hated it when it first came out? I know when it first came out, there were definitely people who liked it, but I think the overall consensus was that it looked like a trash bag, a drawstring bag, but it seems like it's here to stay at least for the foreseeable future. There are several color combinations. You have these denim ones and the small and the large. It comes in that dark pink. It comes in the accru, the minty green, the beige. You have some metallic ones as well, as well as the black one. 
Again, here we have the 22, but in the backpack version. So that denim, that lilac, all of those seasonal colors are there. And this collection also has a lot of seasonal bags. These two at the top seem to be like a satin material. So you have that really pretty turquoise and you have a pink. Then you have some tweeds as well. Those stand out to me. I really like that black and white tweed. That pink tweed is also really pretty. And then of course you have some seasonal bags in that minty green that I love so much. Here we have some more seasonal bags. That top row of seasonal bags though, I, I'm not really a big fan of them. I don't like when they have like the jewels and stuff in the chain and it's really funny because it reminds me of a few seasons ago there's another bag that had different colored jewels throughout the chain and somebody said it was like the Thanos jewels anytime I see bags like this that's all I can think about you also have this denim bag which I'm not really a big fan of this denim this season I've seen better denims in past seasons so this one is definitely not for me the one that interests me out of this is like the one at the bottom that east west bag here we have it in a beige but they also have it in what looks to be like a silk satiny black and it has like a jeweled CC which I think is so beautiful and elegant that bag would be perfect as like an event bag or an evening bag so that one definitely caught my eye so for fans of the 19 there are several options this season including tweed first we have that purple tweed let me know what you think about that one my initial thought in my head was Barney when I first saw that one so it's not my favorite of the 19s this season. Next we have this dark green. We have minty green as well as that beautiful lilac pink. Then we have one that is like a dark blue mixed with like black and white. And then finally we have it in beige. Next we have some more seasonal bags in the white, black, and denim as well as the dark green. I do see a reissue mini in the dark pink with gold hardware. That one really stands out to me. And then at the bottom we have this white and then this pink seasonal bag that reminds me of the Papillon Louis Vuitton bag style. Those really stand out to me. Next we have this round vanity case in the green. There's also some boy bags this season. So first we have this black boy bag with the chain going around the flap. So it's more of an embellished boy bag. We also have the regular boy bag in that gorgeous beige. Then we have that chain boy bag in the green, the dark green as well. We have a messenger version of it. And then Next we have this other bag and I forget off the top of my head what this bag was called but it's the one with the really big chunky chain that debuted a few seasons ago. I'm not a huge fan of the chunky chain but that pink is a gorgeous pink. There's another 22. Then we have this other seasonal bag. This seasonal bag has Chanel on the chain on top and I have seen it in other colors. I saw it in this dark pink as well as black. And next to it is that East West bag that I was talking about earlier in the beautiful black silky satin material with the jeweled cc's that one is absolutely gorgeous it's really sticking out to me here's some more seasonal bags and the thing about the seasonal bags this season is there are going to be a lot of caviar options so if you're looking for a caviar bag at a lower price point that isn't the classic flap there will be several options for you to check out at the boutique I really like this green one and this blue one that blue color really stands out to me and then at the bottom you have like this incognito two-tone bag with the pink and the minty green. And then again here we have even more seasonal bags. Now the one that stands out to me from this slide is going to be like that moon shaped bag and I've seen this in a lot of photos on social media since the VIPs have been starting to see the collection. I've seen it in this white color in a black color as well as that gorgeous dark green. This bag has a chain going around the bottom. It has the classic chain with the leather woven throughout and a CC charm as well. I've seen it in black green and white and then here we have more two-tone seasonal bags so two-tone is really a concept that they're introducing a lot this season again lots of gorgeous beiges that hobo bag is back from 23c in the beige and that really beautiful sky blue as well then you have a larger papillon style bag so this is in the dark pink and then next to it i really like that dark blue it looks very pretty as well again some more totes if you are a tote bag person there are a lot of of options for you this season we have this 19 style tote then we have this this tote on the top right that one 
I, I mean, maybe if I see it in person, I might like it because it's kind of hard to tell from this picture, but so far that one's not really a winner in my book. We also have that tote that we saw earlier, but more of a north-south shape. Then these next totes, I actually do like these, and these are more of a classic style tote. I like them as well. This season, there's also going to be some iridescent metallic-y style bags, so if you like those, take a look at these they're absolutely gorgeous first we have this mermaid green and it comes in the mini as well as the medium classic flap size then we have this like iridescent dark pink absolutely gorgeous this one is in the medium size the one that i also really like apart from the green that really stands out to me is this purpley icy bag this reminds me a lot of like the frozen bags people were talking about a few years ago but like better i love this one the frozen bags came in like different ombre colors and then ultimately i think they ended up being canceled in the classic flap. This purple though, absolutely stunning. Then there's also this like icy, I don't know if that's white or silver, but that looks gorgeous as well. And then finally we have like this beigey pink one. And this kind of looks like, it's hard to tell from the photo, but to me it looks like it's like in a velvety or maybe like a suede material. If you know what this is, let me know in the comments below, but that one definitely looks interesting. Of these six, the standout colors to me are those gorgeous green mermaid ones and the icy purple. All right guys, so well, that's it for this video for 23P. Let me know in the comments below Below if you had a favorite color, a favorite bag. Again, this collection drops on January 24th here in the US, so just in a few days time. And if you've been one of the lucky VIPs to see this collection early, let me know in the comments below what you thought. I can't wait to hear your thoughts. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I know a lot of you watch my channel and haven't yet subscribed and subscribing really helps small creators like myself. So any subscribers, I definitely appreciate you and I love this little luxury posse that we're building. And you can also click the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos. I'm not on a set schedule at the moment, so that is the best way to get notified when I do upload again. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.